Hey everybody, welcome, welcome to Two Feet Toe. I pray that you're doing absolutely amazing today. Today is the day the Lord has made. Let us rejoice in it. I hope and I pray that you start to focus on what's important in your life. I want to talk to you about something that we all know well. Uh, you see, most times people, they're jealous of you. Not because of your accomplishments. They're jealous of your confidence. Because you are a reminder to them that the same thing that broke them is what built you up. See, when you go through the same thing that other people do, is then you come out better than they become. You come out better on the other side, and they're still stuck in that pain. Uh, they wonder, well, why did she take that? You know, she took those lemons that life threw at her, and she made lemon cake and lemon uh, cookies and lemonade, and you're still stuck with that sour puss on your face because you've been sucking on that lemon honey. It's what you do with the situations in life, right? It's the perspective. That's what we need to remember. Um, you need to remember that you are a living letter that is written by God so that other people may read. You are an example. How you live your life uh, will show others who is inside of you, right? The truth in you will determine your walk. You can only walk in the light of the truth that is in your heart, right? And what fills your heart will find its way out of your mouth, honey. Ooh, from the abundance of your heart, thy mouth shall speak, right? Remember, God's love is unconditional, but his promises are not. Uh, God will continue to reveal his truth to us until it can be seen in our lifestyle and in how we treat others. I pray today that you reevaluate your life, that you stop and think to yourself, what comes out of your mouth? What are you thinking about? What are you meditating on? Are you meditating on the truth of God or are you meditating and going over the same cycle, going over that, I call it the rerun, that, that rerun that, go, that loops in your mind over and over again and there's nothing you can do about it. Learn to let go, learn to trust God, learn to walk in his truth, in his light. And uh, from the abundance of your heart, thy mouth shall speak. So check your heart, y'all. What's in your heart? I pray that what comes out of your mouth is what's in your heart. And what's in your heart is the love of God. I pray this in the glorious name of Jesus. I am on Love Lane and Peace Place. Where are you at? Holla.